right, here we go. We're going to I Got Your Pistola to kick off game number two. Guys, last event, he had the most positive kill to death spread out of any player, but I think almost 96. The second place guy, I think, was either Enable or Snipe Down. Pistola dropped positive 214. Uh, I, think, I think more impressively, he was at a 1.4 to 4 kill death ratio. And he got 1.44 kills per death. That is absurd in Halo, especially in Halo Rush. And uh, what I want you guys to look, watch for when you're watching I Got Your Pistol, see how much damage he inflicts before being taken out. Even if he knows he's going to die, he's going to push out and land the melee right before being taken out. He's so incredible. There he got a kill and an assist with the same grenade shot. Six to five, though. Believe the hype coming out strong. And I really like this game type for Believe the Hype. I think the last game we talked about it, they need to put that behind them. And this is the game type they can be able to win, pull out, and get some momentum back. And I do want to make a quick correction. Sorry, I got some wrong information. Straight Ripping has already beaten Believe the Hype. So BTH really needs to win this series to have a chance of making it out of their pool. And we saw Stray Rip do a great job against uh, Instinct at the last land. I mean, those stats don't necessarily pertain to this, but Stray Ripin took Instinct to 10 games in the final tournament. So right now, they're looking like the team that's going to be able to upset Instinct. But at the same time, right now, believe the hype, not far behind. I'd love to see what's going on with this BTH squad. There you see Neighbor doing a nice job. Three down here for Instinct. So BTH taking map control, and they're now up by five as we stay on board with Neighbor. We're actually going over to Clutch, and Scott, this is one of your favorite players in the entire venue. I love Clutch. There's just not enough I can say about him. He talks trash. He makes big plays. He's just an awesome guy to hang with, out with. He's a really down-to-earth player. And, you know, you get that stuff out of him, you know, potty mouth, but, I mean, the guy's awesome. But the statement I want to make is if there's a game type that Instinct's going to lose, it is going to be the Team Slayers. They lost a lot of the Team Slayers because they started off with a huge lead and couldn't close. And it looks like they didn't even get a lead in this one, so Team Slayers are kind of iffy for them. Well, it's kind of funny. We talked about the, the stats from the five-team land, and right now Zealot Slayer. FB going, or my, I'm sorry, Instinct going six and three, Believe the Hype going one and eight, which means so far what we've talked about it. It means that right now Believe the Hype has the advantage somehow. I mean, it seems that those stats always are wrong right now in the tournament. And if you guys are keeping a track on the forums for us, I believe that is now 1.5 FB slips. <laughs> I'm guessing we're getting at least was 12 before the end of this weekend. No, it was Chris. Oh ah, well, we're good. All, all, all good. We're going to keep getting that wrong, but hey, we'll learn it eventually as Instinct becomes the next dynasty here at MLG. Just an early prediction. 26 to 25, though. It's a very tight game. Believe the hype. Losing that seven kill lead as it looks like Instinct is going to take the lead now. 28 to 26. And Pistola is going to pick up that grenade launcher. Perfect shot there. Helping Neighbor pick up the, or helping Ogre 2 pick up the kill on Neighbor. I don't understand how he doesn't kill his teammate there. And now he's going to get one kill. Wasn't there another guy down there? Now okay, well, he got one, and now he's going to lay down shots. He does inflict so much damage on the other team. I'm so glad you pointed it out because it's such a vital part of this whole game. This is so fun watching Halo right now. <laughs> I got my eyes on Roy's screen. He just had the killing screen, picked up the double kill as well. He's positioned top, middle, but he's getting all kinds of help from the perimeter. You got Pistola, who's going to run bottom, and he's going to run around the sides. Lunchbox and Ogre 2 are really being the guys doing the support role. They're locking down the position. Yeah, believe the hype was in this game in the beginning, but when they were in this game, they were controlling the power up and they were keeping it out of Final Boss hands. But it seems as soon as that, or, oh God, Instinct, I keep, <laughs> gonna keep doing it, I'm sorry, but the, as soon as Instinct got those weapons, they went on literally a 10 to 0 run on this, on this Believe the Hype squad. Believe the Hype has any chance, they need to get these weapons. We got Lunchbox position, top gold, he was weak, Roy comes over immediately to help him out, 41 to 29, make it 42 to 29 there after another snipe from Lunchbox, all four players from Instinct really clicking here, they are showing their strength in this game number two, 
and they are keeping the pressure on BTH here. Neighbor getting away. Roy making one of his few mistakes just an inch away from connecting with that back smack. But if we can, let's get our camera over to I Got Your Pistol or Ogre 2. There's Ogre 2 on your screen. Both of these guys just want some huge individual battles, and both of their DMRs are on fire. Talk about such an even team. No one player standing out. It is the, it is the entire team. It's so impressive. I, I love watching this team. All right, we are done talking about our love for instinct. You guys, we'll let you talk about it on the forums. 46 to 39 here as I Got Your Pistola is going here on the flank. He's got injured neighbor in front of him, getting the kill before being taken out. Roy laying down some heavy fire from across the map, and he's got Lunchbox and Ogre 2 with him here as they're trying to push up the spiral. Roy hits the headshot before Cloud and gets the melee off. That's going to make it an easy one shot for I Got Your Pistola. He's going to clean that one up for 49, and now they're looking for 50. And check out the instinct swarm. you got three players all running together. Roy getting a new angle. Lunchbox calling him out under the, base, under the base and connects with the grenades. Instinct now up 2-0 to zero over Believe the Hype, and they are not looking back. After a slow start, they really turned it on there. And each player, as you mentioned, Scott, taking turns to do the damage. When we get a chance, I'd love to check out their stats here. Check out that spread you got. I got your Pistola with five assists, five assists from Roy, four assists from Ogre 2, and Lunchbox has six. And three of the four players going positive. Yeah, big game again by Roy. Even though their team has seemed to be very even throughout, Roy's been putting up.